unlikely duo, Macho Sylvester Stallone, best known as Rocky, and Dolly Parton, the larger-than-life country singer. But they're together tonight to celebrate the opening of their first team effort, a comedy film called Rhinestone. In the three Rocky movies, Sylvester Stallone conquered some pretty tough characters. But Rhinestone is different. Dolly Parton shows us that all it takes is a sweet-talking country girl to conquer Sylvester Stallone. We're just sweet, First, when I met him, I, I loved him instantly. And I, I think we just struck up a wonderful, lasting friendship. And, and the days on the set, every day was a joy. And I loved his energy and his personality. And he was very protective of me. And... I'll never forget the first time I met her, I came to the door, she was dressed all in black and had a meat cleaver. And it was really a warm <laughs> <awesome. laughs> And you'd be uh, from then on, you'd be fast friends, You make right? one small move and your head is mad. Oh, how you doing? Nice night. You look... In Rhinestone, Sly plays Nick Martinelli, a happy-go-lucky cab driver who hasn't made a right move in his whole life. Enter Dolly. A lady who knows all the right moves. She plays Jake Ferris, a nightclub performer who bets her boss that she can turn anyone into a country singer. All bets are on when her prospect turns out to be Sly. Like his character, Nick, Sly is indeed a city boy. Raised in one of the toughest parts of New York City, he hoped that acting would be the way out. But for years, Sly was rejected by every casting agent in New York. Then came stardom with Rocky, followed by a series of roles that seemed to typecast Stallone. The offbeat character of Nick Martinelli is quite a departure for Sly. I mean, uh, you know, some people, they may think you're real cute, but me, Nick, I kind of think you're this reject from he so why don't you I'm a big believer in what Shakespeare said, you know, to those who think life is a comedy, those who feel life is a tragedy. So, I, you know, if you look around, there's so much absurdity, there's so much fun that we try to pull it out. Mm -hmm. I mean, you are the most absurd thing <laughs> I've ever seen, and I am sure I'm the most absurd. No, but ever. actually, he was, I was really impressed with him, because I wondered myself, because of the roles that he played, if he would be funny, mm -hmm. if he really could do comedy. And he had me laughing. I couldn't even do my scenes, because they just left my laughing in, because I was <laughs> laughing in places where I wasn't supposed to. <laughs> I was supposed to be acting. Yeah. But oh, he yeah. absolutely tickles me to death. He's a crazy person. Sly, she seems to keep you in line. She's making sure that you look good and your hair's in place. Is she always like that? Has it always been that way? She's very tribal, you know, like... The African baboons, they, they're grooming, they're picking. <laughs> and, oh, she's like very, very basic. So I, I'm always like being cleaned up. She's wonderful that way. She's really wonderful. I don't know how pretty you want to look. She, she's so excellent. You know, she's got, if she had 92 children, they'd never get to school. She, uh, they'd be like graduating college, still hadn't oh. left yet. <laughs> I'm not going to fix you up no, anymore. I'll, I'll, she's one. She really Wait, is great. <laughs> I would spend for you a blanket. Dolly's mother hen instinct started early in life. As the fourth of 12 children, she helped raise the younger ones. It wasn't easy, but she drew on the experience to write some of her hit songs. While Dolly's music career has flourished, her movie career has had its ups and downs. Nine to Five was a hit, but Best Little Whorehouse was not. Rhinestone is her third and favorite film. So there will be more films together? I hope so. I hope this is a hit so we can do something else together. Because yeah. if it's a flop, I ain't never want to see it. If your nothing else, again. I'm gonna, I'll... <laughs> I would like to fight her in Rocky IV. Uh, yeah, I can do, be working wardrobe. I told him, look, if we don't make it together, just let me work in wardrobe. When you see the film, she does pack a hell of a punch, though, that's right. Oh, yeah. Just sweet loving friends. Just sweet loving friends. Just sweet.